welcome everyone today in this video we are going to learn about new feature of square gear delay frame and set a render pass as you see in the screen when we tap in the screen it freezes and unfreezes the frame and when we rotate our head it moves the frame let's start by creating new project Let's create required asset for our project. At first, add rectangle to our project. You can resize it as your requirement. Then name it as frame one. We'll be adding material here and name it as frame one as well. Then go to uh, camera and extract texture from there and go to frame one and we'll be adding camera texture here. Now go in frame one and add another rectangle. Size it now. We'll be adding another material here. Name it is outline. Now go to texture, choose file. I have created frame texture array. You can find it in link in description. Now we have created a frame. Now go to frame and press Ctrl D and duplicate. And go to uh, material and create new material. Rename it as frame two, and we'll be adding camera texture here as well. Next, add face tracker. Now we have completed creating asset for our project. Now we'll be starting create patches for our project. Now we'll be creating patches for our project. Go to view and so add patch editor. Drag device to patch. Go to camera texture. And drag it as well. Double click and add in render bus. Uh, it will help to render all the objects from our scene. Then go to device and add render pass as now simply join object with scene object. And Add camera texture as background and texture to screen output. Now you can see same screen which we loaded previously. Next we are going to add screen tab to our project. Go to frame one and create a object tab pass from there. Now we'll be adding switch here. Now we need mix here to mix input values. Connect it to alpha 
now you can see error here because we have not connected two inputs so it is showing error it can be solved later next we'll add set a render pass as we have to render more than one text set. now add delay frame It will help to reuse texture. Next, go to frame one material and create texture patch and simply connect it. Now, go to camera texture and edit in first frame here now we'll be adding tender now we'll be adding receiver here receiver will help to Take information or data from sender without connecting cables. Go here and change number to texture. Go to receiver and choose sender here. Now we'll be adding another receiver. Choose here and select delay frame. Then add it as another input. Now go to here and choose simulate touch. And now you can see when we touch the screen, frame freezes, and when we touch again, it unfreezes. Now we'll create patch for face tracker through which we'll move our frame. Go to interaction and create new patch for head rotation. Add animation here. Now we'll be adding transaction. Change it to vector 2. Now go to frame 1 and note position here 10.5 and 8.5. Now we'll add final frame position. Simply copy it, paste it here, now bring patch from position and connect it, now change Turn left to lean left. Now let's test it. Go to here and choose simulators and click restart. Now it freezes. Now when we turn our head, it moves the frame. Next, we'll work for frame 2. Let's edit the patch first. Next, we'll bring patch from frame 2. Now, 
now we'll follow same step as previous now go here and select all these three and simply copy and paste it and disconnect previous wires connect it to new one now bring texture of frame 2 simply go here and press in texture and connect it frame here and name it as delay frame 2 connect texture to here and connect camera texture to first frame now create another sender change it to texture rename it as sender 2 and connect it to camera texture choose sender 2 and delay frame 2 here and simply connect it delay frame to here and sender 2 here now test it here by clicking it we can see both frame are working now let's change the position of second frame as well go to lean right and drag and add animation here add transaction change it to vector 2 now go to frame 2 and add initial position Now we'll look for final position. Now simply add progress here and bring position as to passes and connect it to here now let's try it to restart now we can see it is working well you can add any uh, face passes and create it as your wish Now we are at the end of our tutorial. If you like this content, please subscribe my channel. Thank you.